Hi there guys, today we're gonna be show you how to upgrade your Windows 10 to Windows 11 for free. This will work on any eligible desktop or laptop PCs if you have an official copy of Windows 10. No matter whether you have bought the license from Microsoft or just an OEM license that comes with your device, you can all get benefited from this. And for some reason if you are running a pirated version of Windows 10, I'm sorry, it will not gonna work for you. By upgrading to Windows 11, most of your install programs, settings and files on your local drives are safe. So don't worry about reinstalling or losing anything. Even though I will not be held responsible for any loss or damage by doing this. If you want the upgrade, do it at your own risk. As you can see, we have already successfully upgraded one of our systems to the new and official build of Windows 11 and by following the video, this is the result you can expect. So without further ado, let's start the upgrade procedure. And before that, we have to make sure your computer is compatible for Windows 11. So as a first step towards that, we recommend you to check your Windows update on Windows settings. So go to your start menu, go for a settings gear icon and on Windows settings, go for update and security. Now you will get to Windows update and check if you received any notification from Microsoft regarding the Windows 11 upgrade. Fortunately, we have received one and in a brief it says, the particular PC can run Windows 11, specific timing for when it will be offered can vary as we get it ready for you. So you might get it today, tomorrow or even after a month, even if you got a notification like this. But we are not gonna wait for that. So let me show you how to check if your PC can run Windows 11 and if it can, how to upgrade it right away. And using the official source and as of now, we are getting the new October 5 public release, not the beta one. So first let me show you how to do the compatibility checkup manually. Go to this website, scroll down and download the PC Health Checkup app. You can find a direct link to this page in the video description. Once you have the program, double click on the exe file and install it. Launch the program when everything is done. Now go ahead and click on the check now button which will run a quick hardware compatibility checkup to make sure your PC is Windows 11 compatible. If you got a check mark like this, you're all set and ready to receive Windows 11, no matter whether you receive that notification from Microsoft or not. But if you unfortunately doesn't meet the certain hardware requirements for Windows 11, you can also find the reason which caused the compatibility check a failure. It might be as silly as enabling the secure boot of firmware TPM on your BIOS or adding an extra stick of RAM. Or it can go as worst as an unsupported CPU, no TPM 2.0, secure boot or lack of any other must-have requirements. But don't worry if you can't do it straight away, Windows 10 is still a great OS and Microsoft will at least support it for another 5 years alongside Windows 11, which will give you plenty of time to either upgrade your PC hardware or to get a new one down the road. So let's move forward and begin the upgrade procedure. Hope the compatibility checkup was a success for your system. To start the upgrade process manually, we have to get the Windows 11 installation assistant program. And for that, you have to go to another Microsoft web page. As always, links will be in the video description. Once you downloaded it, ran it, and you'll be presented with this window, which will ask you to accept the license agreement to begin the upgrade process. So go ahead and click on the accept and install button, which will start downloading Windows 11. It might take 5 minutes or an hour depending on your internet speed, so be patient and let it finish. As you can see, it's just finished the downloading process and began to verify the downloaded files, which will bring us to the third and final step on the Windows 11 installation assistant, which is preparing Windows 11 files for installation. It might take a very long time, so be patient and try not to abort the process. And once the currently running process is finished, the program will start a countdown of 30 minutes to restart your PC for the installation process. So at this point, I recommend you to stop your work and save it if you're doing something important. As you can see, the files preparation process has just got finished. So click restart now, which will show you the warning dialog box, close it, wait for a second and your computer will restart. During the installation process, it will automatically restart your computer at certain periods. So please do not interfere with the process at this point and give it time until it finishes. Also keep your PC plugged in all time during the procedure and do not turn it off at all costs. Beware avoiding these instructions may cause serious issues such as system malfunction or data loss. As you can see the installation is just began and it will only take up to 5 to 10 minutes if you are using an SSD. On a hard drive it might take longer than that. So let's wait for it to finish. As you can see the installation process is kind of finished and it will ask you to log into the desktop 
So just enter your PIN or password which you have previously used on your Windows 10. And I will start the final preparation process which also takes a minute or two. And there you go, it's just finished the Windows 11 installation process. And because this is an upgrade rather than a clean install from Windows 10 to Windows 11, it brought along my old Windows 10 wallpaper with it. So just give me a second and here we go. Here is Windows 11 in its full glory. It's running the full-fledged official build released on October 5. So that's all for today. That's how you can upgrade your Windows 10 to Windows 11 for free. Hope you like the video. Leave a like if you do. Subscribe to the channel to get more topics like this. And if you found it helpful, why not share with your friends as well.